Hi, everybody. So, it is now the fifth week of the summer 2020 semester, and you're probably going to notice that I'm releasing three videos this week, um, and that's by design. So, this video that you're watching now is going to expire at the end of the week, and then there'll be week six video, week seven, and so on and so forth. The other two videos will be one on the importance of being earnest and one on the actual research paper. I really felt like it would be better to break those three up rather than try and make one great big long video. So um, the earnest video and the research paper videos, those will stay up for the rest of the semester. But this one is just your weekly video. So what are we doing this week? A couple things you need to know. First of all, by the time you watch this video, I will have submitted your midterm grades to the registrar. You need to take a close look at that midterm grade. Um, most of you are doing fine, uh, but there are students in this class who are going to get F's on the midterm simply because they've not turned anything in. Or they've not turned in essays. Maybe they've done a quiz or two, but not the essays. Um, you really need to think long and hard about whether or not you want to stay in this class for the rest of the summer. Because if you've not turned anything in yet, then I have a hard time believing that you're going to turn anything in during the final four weeks. Uh, the drop deadline is this coming Thursday, which is June 25th. So sometimes people don't turn in work because life happens, okay? There could be a death in the family. They could get sick. Uh, there could be, you know, some other kind of chaos like a divorce or, you know, being arrested or whatever. Um, if you have to drop this class because life has interfered with your ability to do the assignments, there's no shame in that. Go ahead and drop and uh, take, take this class again in the fall or in the spring or whenever you, you know, your uh, situation improves. Um, I had to do it when I was in college. I had a death in the family uh, one semester, and I just, you know, I failed every class I had. And I still managed to uh, graduate anyway. So uh, don't don't uh, be afraid to go ahead and say, I can't do it. I'm going to drop. Um, if the reason you're not doing your assignments is because of laziness, you still need to drop. Because if you were lazy for the first four weeks, you're going to be lazy for the remaining four weeks. But your midterm grades... Uh, will be submitted by the time you watch this video and will likely uh, appear uh, within the next couple of days or so. I believe the school is going to send you an email letting you know that, uh, if that's the case. All right, so that's the first thing. This week we're starting the importance of being earnest, and then that's going to lead to the research paper, which will be on the importance of being earnest. So um, really what you need to do just for this week is go ahead and uh, read the story, take the quiz. Now you're going to see it's 89 pages. Don't be daunted by that. This is not 89 pages of a novel or 89 pages of a how-to manual or anything like that. This is 82 pages of a play, which means that you're going to get people's dialogue with a few stage directions and maybe a, you know, a few things about the uh, uh, setting. And we'll talk more about that in the earnest video. But this week, at the very minimum, go ahead and read that play and take that earnest quiz because I want you to understand the play. And then next week, um, certainly do your research and come up with an outline for the research paper. Then you're going to write a first draft of the research paper. And then we and I are going to conference over it. And then uh, we will uh, have you do a final draft, which you will turn in as your final assignment. All right. That will be your final exam, by the way, is that research paper's final draft. So for this week, get started on earnest. Go ahead and read it. Uh, understand it uh, take the quiz it's a very hilarious play i every time i read it i find myself laughing out loud and i have also seen it perform live and uh it's very very funny that way as well so um don't be daunted by this big research paper project we're spending four weeks on it you're going to have plenty of time if you pace yourself to get it all done without uh over stressing so uh, that's what we're doing for this week if you haven't done your poetry or your prose work, get it in or else make your decision about whether you want to stay in the class or not. 